Okay, so we left off, we wanted to create our family types now because we have the brains, the bones, the body, and we have the balance. But now, if I want to create a what? A new type, I can call this type, maybe I call this dining room table, okay? And I say I want my dining room table to have a table depth. Maybe I want it to be, oh, three feet. And I want the width to be eight feet. And I want the height to stay there, but I want my table leg to be also four inches. I can say, okay, and it flexes. Flexes then I can go back and I can say instead of a dining room table in this case I want a what a kitchen table maybe it's a little smaller and I can say for the kitchen table value that I want what a depth of maybe four foot but also a width of four foot and then I maybe want the table leg to be three. And then I can hit OK, and it flexes. It flexes. That's important. Now let's say I want one more for right now. I say, how about a desk? Right? Just a simple desk. And I say OK. And I want the depth of that to be two foot. And I want the leg to stay at three, but the width to be five foot. And the height, perhaps, the height on this, again, could stay the same. But if we wanted to adjust it, let's say for some strange reason we wanted it only to be, I don't know, uh, 20, 25. So that would be two foot one. And I hit apply. And then there's my desk. And if I go to a 3D view, not this 3D view, that's back in my project. I have to open up my own 3D view here. If I pull up my family types, right, I can look at the dining room table. And I can also look at the kitchen table. Okay. Now, you're thinking, Joel, what about this ugly line between here and here? What if I said join geometry? Remember this from our roofs a while back? If I click here and say join this with this, now that line goes away because the geometry is all joined together. All right? So we've learned now that with different parameters, we can create different types within this family. These are type parameters. We'll test another class about how we can make instance parameters. But in the final video that we do today, we're going to work on the last and probably one of the more important things to some of you, and that's the materials of the family. I'll go ahead and stop this, and we'll pick up in the last video.